channel and I can't lie this is actually a few days after the vlog has been filmed because basically I need to film an intro. We've had some technical difficulties shall I say so I missed Sunday's upload because I filmed a full video on my new Sony camera which I'm filming on right now and the lens was just black. It looked like the cap was on it. I know it wasn't because I was like taking pictures and stuff whilst I was doing that video and yeah there was no lens cap on but all of the clips were just black with no sound so I don't know what happened there and then I finally had a play around with the camera had a google of what it could be and set everything up like it should be started this week's vlog and it started with me and Sam on Saturday going to the flat baker and it was so cute I do have a little vlog of it up on my tiktok if you want to watch it but all the clips when I came to send them to Callum they were all in slow-mo with no sound <laughs> so this vlog wouldn't have made sense if I didn't do a little intro like this because all of a sudden I thought that oh my god all my clips are gonna be in slow-mo with no sound so I've got another wasted vlog I'm gonna miss another upload I was so sad I was nearly crying but then I was flicking through and I realized I must have clipped something on the camera and when I'm in the car with my mum and Sam and we went to Wagamama's on Saturday afternoon all the clips are back to normal so that's how this vlog is gonna start with us going to Wagamama's on Saturday afternoon I'm so sorry that the morning has been missed out and I'm introing the vlog like this but I hope you enjoy the video I still wanted to put out the video because it was like a little cutesy like weekend vlog with my friends with my family and there's some funny bits in it which I really wanted you to see so enjoy the video and let's fingers crossed hope and pray hello Mr Pickles that everything is sorted now and that's not gonna happen again oh you're gonna say bye you're gonna say bye I love you we both of you all happy watching we've got a little visitor with us now mom did come with us in the end because my dad forced her and you're excited now aren't you because you i knew you wanted a wagamama's mom loves wagamama's just like me and we've got grump of the week here why am i grumpy you tell me why are you grumpy I'm grumpy he seems grumpy but we're gonna go into waggers now we're at ashton moss it's the closest wagamama's to my mother and father I can't wait i love you i love you we've arrived guys you can't really see me because my camera is blocking me hey sam look Oh, wow. <laughs> See you in there. So really, that looks like I'm looking at you. But no, jokes, guys. He's there. What to get? I was just saying to everyone, I just want one of everything. The moment has arrived. My edamame. I'm just waiting on some sriracha sauce for that. But look at my mum's drink. That's so cute. What was it called? Cherry blossom. Cherry blossom lemonade. Oh, it looks so sweet. Got these. So good. Oh, it's beautiful, that. So good. Sam just had a massive salty one. I could eat edamame with sriracha with garlic salt on for the rest of my life. Oh, it's a must with edamame. Some of my little side no, orders are here already. My two pots of kimchi. Anything pickled on Wagamanda's menu, I'm having it. Look how many things that I have ordered. I've got two starters, I've got a main, that's my drink, and then I've got two of every pickled object on the menu for the side. So this is the kimchi. Do you want one of these, Mom? Pickled no, cardboard. No, it's not. This quality of this camera, I can't get over it. It's incredible. Well worth the money. The quality is so much better on here. Like in low light, like we are now, my Canon could never. And look at the focus. Do you see how good that focus was? Mm -mm -mm. I love me some kimchi. Also, kimchi has got really good bacteria in, so it's really good for your body. Well, I love it. Do you know what, guys? I ordered the sedamame. It's all bloody gone. That's More pickled one. vegetables are coming. These are Japanese pickles. Get off. Sam's stealing them. I always have to get two because I know people are going to eat them and I want at least a full one to myself. These are Japanese pickles. They are so nice. You're about to spill off. Taste Not best. Me. They're sweet, the vinegary. Mm. That was a baby out of mommy. Get the sriracha on there. I'll catch up with you when more food is. My food has arrived, well, some of it. My Ebby Cat suit is one of my favourite things in the world. I'm in heaven. The pickled ginger has arrived. Oh, my mum is so warm. Sam's bowel buns have arrived. Will be nice. What is it? Oh, yeah, pork and apple. I'm really not. That is my bowel buns, I've got some white greens that I'll share with my mama. I'm really sad that they don't put pak choy in it anymore. Pak choy is really good, yeah, wasn't it? Yeah, no, they don't. Oh, no, I thought there was something missing yeah, in I it. I love my pak choy. My pad thai is come, but I don't get any chicken. I just get prawns. Sam, what's yours? I can't pronounce it. Okay. <laughs> some, something chicken. I can't pronounce it. Nez or mums. Something curry. We have wok fried greens. I'm going to do a little taste test. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh, my God. That piece of broccoli just swung around like a crane and dripped on my phone, but not on me. That was lucky. We'll have a green bean, I think. 
Oh wow, I can't explain how incredible this is. I've had ties here. On every day. We've just been to Tesco, Sam did his food shop. I just got a few bits and bobs. I got all my canned drinks, so then I didn't have to carry them. Sam so felt carry them. But we did pick up these. We found these, true through. So we got the strawberries, which are in milk chocolate and white chocolate. And we also got the raspberries, which are in white chocolate and dark chocolate. So let's try them. Ooh, smell. Quick test. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, the healthy mm. treats, basically. Very nice. Mm. Woo. Thank you. you ready? These are raspberries now. ASMR. Mmm. Mum, mm. hot would you ASMR? Are you in the background? Nice because they're sweet. They're tart. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, yeah. They're tarty. Oh, nice. Mmm. Look at that. Dad, you should see the speed of what this focus is. What also focus? Mm. Well, they last till we get home. <laughs> My dad was like, no. This looks very nice. I've been brought up to say oh. please and thank you after every word of a sentence by my mum and dad. And now, as my dad gets older and older, he doesn't use his manners, do ya? He just goes like this with his hand and expects some chocolate raspberries to fall into it. Alrighty, Rue, we're gonna get pickles. I'm gonna go back because Sam's got some raw ass chicken in the boot of the car, haven't you? And I've got my um, frozen. You say hi, mum. I'm gonna go make some cookies. Bye. Bye oh boy, love you babes, boy. Love you babes. And I need to get these back in the freezer and then yeah, we're gonna make cookies and chocolate covered strawberries. Oh, oh we have these. Oh well, you see you at home. Hi friends, it's a little bit later. Well, it's actually not, it's only been like an hour. We drove home, we are now home. I'm dressed like a weirdo. I think I've got the stabilization mode on because we're really zoomed in, aren't we? And we're making cakes. Hella zoomed. Not making cakes, making gooey cookies. I've got my robe on. That's the story in Balamori. As people would say, we got a lot of eggs. So I'm trying to find a cookie recipe. You have to bend down. Bend down, boy. I've got my appetizer. I bought it at Tesco's two, before. Two, two sugars are better than one. Yeah. Preheat oven, yeah. Have you, have you preheated the oven? No, because I didn't know what happened. Right. This says 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit. Mm. Right, preheat oven. Yes. And line a large baking sheet. In a medium bowl, whisk together the flour, so you know, baking soda, baking powder, and salt. Baking soda, I got baking soda. In a large mixing bowl, add the melted butter. It's important the butter is not hot. So what are we doing? I'm just reading it. Baking soda. Do you want to get baking soda out? Baking powder. We've got both. No. Kosher salt. No, we've got no kosher salt. Unsalted butter. Uh, this is an American recipe. This is why you've got like funky things in there. So That's why it's like that. all purpose flour. That We don't call it all purpose flour. So we have plain so flour and self raising flour. No, you can, but that's why I'm saying you. Okay. Saying what's this? In what's a medium that? You can put, it's like kosher salt is sea salt. So okay. if you want to put a bit of salt in, baking with salmon is always fun. So what, 165 grams of that? Should put a full one in. <laughs> He's back again. The sneezy man. Shall I go and warm this up? So it's saying 100 grams of light brown sugar and 75 grams, so you need 175 grams of that sugar. I melted the butter, but I've done it so there's still a few like little lumps in it so it'll cool down quicker. Too many cooks in the kitchen. Burn. We'll spoil the broth is what we learned. <laughs> it's now time to mix the butter. Well, we need. We also need to put in. No, it said mix, mix them together vigorously. And then you add in the eggs and the vanilla. You ready, guys? Boring. I've got my little whisk. Just combine this. Egg and vanilla. Looks so um, weird, guys. We secured the vanilla. We found it. It was in the most random place. Yeah, it's saying mix the egg and vanilla in this like buttery, sugary mixture. In a buttery biscuit base. Is that it? A buttery flaky biscuit base. Who's Who's that off? What's that from? One, two. Oh, he wants a bit more. He wants vanilla cookies. But, oh, what's that? It's got a little blood thing in it. Nipple. Kill the yolk. I want to get the um, minging thing out. The blood. Where is it? There it's out. I'm going to show you a close up. Keep on staring. You got me staring. I'm with you. Dum, 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 dum. Got me staring. Oh, you stir that mixture. Woo! You go, girl. Good job at that. You always seem to have a hat on when we do this. Because my hair's You had a hat on when we made the other ones. <laughs> I don't see what's wrong with it. Delightful. Right now, chocolate chips. Oh, is it chocolate chipper time? 240 grams of each. There's 100 grams in each, so just put on. both in. We got milk chop chip. Can I focus? Wow. <laughs> so we got. Focus. Wow, that's sick. White chocolate chip. White chocolate. And milk chocolate chip. Pour it at the same time. Sprinkle! Do you know, for a second I was like, well, I've got white ones. This is a lot of I was going to say, it seems like a lot of chocolate chips. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> for this mixture, it's just basically chocolate chip. It's a lot of hooky chocolate chips in there. Oh no, I don't think we should have put that many in. 240 grams, is it? There's more chips in butter. 
I mean, we could always make some more batter. Yeah. But if you think about it, they're not chocolate chips. I know it's the same no, way. No, 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 they're no. bigger, aren't they, than a chocolate chip? It'll be all right. They're chocolate chunks. What, do you want to make some more batter? No, no, it'll be fine. They'll just be extra chocolatey. I really hope these are good. We've, we've both been trying to make, or well, trying to master cookies, haven't we? Yeah, mine it's... turned out like, <laughs> don't even know. <laughs> do, you want, right, do, do you want me to tell you what Amelia's turned out like? <laughs> so imagine a cake that's gone stale, and you get that texture of like a powdery, <laughs> do you know what I mean? <laughs> what? You try. I tried with no scales in the lakes for you finishing your diet. Everyone ate them, but probably no one liked them. I you know what I actually really like. I did like them. They were like, like a texture. biscuit. They weren't. It wasn't like stale cake, but I know what you mean. They were a biscuit, oh, like yeah. a shortbread biscuit. Yeah, I'm just using the same same sort of paper that we did the other day. All right, you go go. We want cute medium sized cookies. I was gonna say cute medium sized melted chocolate. Can you see, guys, how many chocolate chips? Can we just make big ones? No, we want them to be like that nice size, don't we? They're gonna be too big, I'm not gonna lie. Mm, I think we half them. Well, why don't we do some big ones in here and the other two do the other ones? The quality is just spectacular. Of what, not my of the bacon? Cookie, no. No. <laughs> of the, um, not of the batter mix, no. No, Sam, that is actually ginormous. But we're doing these ones a big one, remember? Lads are so funny. It's the final cookie do do. How long does that recipe say to cook them for? 12 to 15 minutes. I mean, so I say 10 minutes and then we'll look at them. Got the monstrous cookies here. I think it doesn't do good though. We need two trays, don't we? Or do they, oh, does that slot in? I've not done too high. Perfect. What time is it? Just set a timer. It's 19.22. We've started the timer for 11 minutes and hopefully we'll open the oven to gooey cookies. They're ready, they're ready, they're ready. Ooh. Oh yeah, they are going in a bit. Oh, wow. Ooh. I can tell they're going to be nice and gooey, can you? Yeah, I feel like they're going to be nice and gooey. Ah! Yeah, they're going to be gooey. <laughs> they're the big puppies. We'll let them cool down a little bit and then we can have some. <gasps> Ooh. Should we put some salt on them? No. No. Don't we get yeah. too excited. Let me send my friends a picture. You have no friends. I'm your only friend. You're a Sorry. Why are you so close? And it's extra close because it zooms in. Oh, just a proud dad taking a picture of his cookie babies. Cookie babies. So I'm just here making pickled scrambled egg for his tea. And Sam is just staring, waiting to eat these cookies. Stop fingering no, them. Because I bet you've been picking your nose and everything and scratching your bum. And now you're touching the nice gooey cookies. But Joanna, He's stood here for Joanna, about 10 minutes waiting. Joanna, like, Joanna, is it time yet? Is Joanna, it time yet? Do you want the line nice and hot? That is a good time to eat them. Yeah, well, you don't want them too hot. They will honestly scold your mouth, they're still boiling. Yeah, they are. <laughs> it's dinner time! We love this chucky egg. He loves his chucky egg. Here are cookies. What should we do? A snap test? Yeah, gooey. Ready? They're quite overdone. They're overdone. How? Yeah. They're all right. They're just really overdone. They're nice. Though. They're nice. They're really nice. We tried. Tune in next week for the next episode of Baking with Amelia and Sam. Well, yeah, Apparently we're doing it every week baking. They're nice though. It's a bit more gooey. Well, like, that's gooey, yeah? Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. So, my f ones are the best ones. Mm. Really? For the 11 minute cook, yeah. Just admit it. On the recipe, it did say, let's do five. Mmm. I just thought we'd have more then, do you know what I mean? Anyone want to see a gooey cookie? <laughs> <laughs> so gooey. <laughs> Watch. Cracker. Put some jam on that, it'd be great. I have no idea. What, ice cream? No. You want a bisque off or not? Is this your cheat day or something? A little bit. He's going in. What are these like, if we break it in half? That's gooey. And those big ones are nice. I think they were my idea. And now, guys, we are just chilling, watching the 1% Club. What's this question? Which of these sporting events would you most associate with the magnificent bird? The FA Cup. Doesn't that have a bird on it? Oh, no, is it the Olympics? Yeah, it's the Olympics. And it's a little mascot, the Olympics. Or oh, there'll be a bird's name within those answers, I bet, that we just don't know that bird. I'm thinking of Everton's logo because of football. Ooh. 11 people that we watched. Come on. It is B. Owl! Owl. Oh. Can we use our pass on that? That's bullshit. Or we rewind it, re video it. No, <laughs> we're not cheating, Sam. Right, we passed, guys. Here's my, here's my thousand. We're still in. Here's my thousand. Oh, now we're chilling, killing, watching the One Percent Club. We're actually doing really well, minus that question. All the other questions I've been getting right. Sam so got the first one, second one wrong. Potatoes, I got it right. Potatoes. Good morning, friends. It's the next day now. We literally just watched One Percent Club and then went to bed. Watched a Beta Squad video, actually, didn't we? Um, mafia. We watched the Mafia because we were playing it in the Lake District. But it's now 
Sunday. Sam is going to the foot of the ball, to aren't you? United. He's going to watch United. Are you looking at there or on there? I'm looking at you. Anyway. Looking at your beauty. <laughs> <laughs> but Sam's going. He just stood on my foot. Sam's going to United, so I'm going to my mum and dad's again with my grandmas. Sarah, Ethan are coming. So that's where we're going now because we're going to have a little family afternoon. We're going to get a takeaway. We're going to get an Italian, I think, because this is like my favourite Italian ever in gossip called Napoli. So nice. I'm currently using Sam's protein powder. Is it protein? Protein powder, which protein I need to fill up. For a little tripod. So we will get going. I've just packed my bag and then me and Mr. P are going to drive to my mum and dad's again. I literally filled up a full tank of petrol the other day cost me 117 pounds and it's nearly all gone but that's where we're gonna go today and have a little wholesome afternoon i love my sundays with my family they were gonna come here actually but they have to come in two cars because of how big the dogs are and sarah and ethan are coming now so it's just easier for me to go there so let's go we need to set off there you go you can have your protein powder back now this is what i was using to stand my camera on on its little tripod what flavor this one is cinnamon bun cinnamon bun you smell it? it smells a bit like vanilla cupcake to be honest are you ready to go sir have we got his um things his harness his lead all that good stuff i might have one more cookie i had a cookie this morning Tee. when we make them again do you know what else i think they're a bit too sugary which is, mm -hmm. no which, which is why they have burnt like that mm -hmm. do you want me to pick them up no the bottom of it's like really really greasy mm. Mm -hmm. here's some more Mm -hmm. it's what? dancing and singing as you eat. Sam's just throwing Pickles harness at Pickles and said, put your harness on. <laughs> Look at him. He's not a very good listener, as you can see. Can I show? Put it on. Put it on. I'm going to go in. Get you. <laughs> You're so cute. Come on in. Jump. Go up. Three, two, one. Jump. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you do to me. I'm just enjoying my cookie now. Ugh! Did you hear the noise she just made? The worst part about that is she wouldn't have even meant to do that. No, I did. I was trying to go. No, that's just how she eats. It's really not. So I focus on that. Mm. You shut up with that. <gasps> Here he is in his little harness. Some of you were asking about this harness, and it's from Barber. He has a little Barber jacket and a little Barber harness. You're just so cute, oh my goodness. Here's my little OOTD guys. It's some very over baggy, not over baggy, oversized joggers from Zara and the matching top. Just got a Lululemon little crop on. Sam's and my shoes are everywhere. So please ignore that. But yeah, little well, Sunday OOTD. Mr. Biggles, are you ready? You ready to party? Mr. We are now in the car. Right, we are leaving Samantha. Love you, bye. Josh, you too. You. Have a good time at the game. Sam's asking me to repost his <laughs> video before we set off. Comment, woohoo. Star emoji. Okay. <laughs> oh my lord. That scared me. Pickles. Stop it. Pickles. No, no. Right. I'll start my car so we can go because or else Pickles is just going to be barking at this little dog. See if my ghost works because it's very temperamental. There we go. It works fine and dandy. I literally know the way to my house with my eyes closed. Well, to my mum and dad's house with my eyes closed. But I always like to put it in on ways in case there's traffic because I always dread like going onto a motorway and you know get, getting like stuck in standstill traffic. It's me worst nightmare. Let's see if you stay on there whilst we are driving. Absolutely stunning. It's staying still. I mean, it's not going to stay still for that long and I do want to put my music on. So yeah, I'm so excited for my tea though. I'm just really happy that we're getting Napoli. And sorry my head's cut off. I need to sort out my camera mount for um, in my car because I don't have one. I have my phone one. I need to reposition my phone one and I also need to sort out my camera one so then I can prop it up and my head not be cut off because you'll be a little bit higher. I can't wait to show you later as well our tea because if we're going to go to Napoli they do the best gambaroni ever. Gambaroni, if you don't know, it's like big juicy prawns in chili, lemon, garlic, black pepper, salt, butter. So good. I literally get, God, I've said literally about 10,000 times. I'm so sorry. It's so annoying. I get gambaroni for start and then I get linguine gambaroni for me. It's so good. I like it that much. We'll let that Range Rover go because we're a nice human. I'm about to get onto the main road and then onto the motorway. So I will probably catch up with you when I get to mom and dad so I can put my music on and you don't fall and I don't ruin you. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Come show us your new hoodie. Ew. This camera's so good. You look so orange. You want to say hey to my friends? <laughs> I'm at my mom's now. 
We're just looking for houses. We're trying to find me a home. I need a home. And now we're having pork pies because Carol has brought a pork pie. Aren't you, Grandma? Yes. And my mum has just made me a, a, mushroom. a mushroom cup of soup. The best. I'm gonna get the caramelized onion chutney. Do I want to go with? Look at the size of this. It's just a whole pie, isn't it? Can I have that piece? Yeah. I like that whole piece. That? Yeah, I like that whole piece. Yeah. Please. I'm hungry. Dicky bells on it. Ooh. Lovely. Mm, yum, yum, yum. I'm gonna have some of these sticky balsamic onions. <laughs> Dad's ears bricked up then. I said, I'm gonna have some of these sticky balsamic onions, and Dad went, hmm? My stomach is rumbling over. I know, I'm so hungry. Now we can tuck in. Hopefully, this little man won't steal it. I'm feeding Shamu. Gentle, gentle. Okay, take half my finger with you while you have it. Was that good? Did you like it? Oh, my hands are all slack. Ethan. <laughs> Lissy's on her way actually, she's bringing my grandma Pam, she's coming for a brew. And then, I don't know really what the plan is, we're still looking for houses. I need to plan what content I want to film this week actually, on Tick of the Talk. Ethan's gone running to Alicia, probably winking at her. Hello! Baby! Oh, you're up close and personal there, Maxwell! Currently showing Liz the quality of the camera. How good does it look? It's such good quality. That's a really bulky camera. It's not bulky, like it's giving proper camera vibes, but like still on the vlogger side. Too, like, like, it's like a camera. I think it's this lens. Yeah. This feels proper. Yeah. Yeah. Poo! Poo! That stinks! No, stinks. Oh Currently oh sniffing oh Ethan's oh feet. My hair's oh coming out. Oh Look, show everyone your tattoo. <gasps> Ooh! He's been inked. Hi. Adios. Hello. Who's that? Hello. Ethanio. Did you say Ethanio? Yeah, can you give me a massage, Ethan? Just slowly rub them in like that. Thank you. <laughs> It's like a nice exfoliation it on my is. neck. Take my fake tan off with your green socks. Come on then, no, don't push you end up kicking him in the Hello. face. Hello, come here, what's happened? You're so like a big this. nappy. I'm a big <laughs> nappy. Yeah, <laughs> You're a big <laughs> nappy. <laughs> You're a big nappy. <gasps> Brilliant. You're a big dog. Yeah, not got any. You're a big widgie. <laughs> Mom has <laughs> finished her Christmas village. Oh, that's that's what you were doing yesterday, isn't it? So here's the fireplace and here's Santa. Woo! Dog whisperer. I am the dog lady. The dog lady. The dog lady. Is Pickles. Do you ever leave him alone? Penal sight, for God's sake. Penal face. So funny. I found a microphone. I found a microphone. Put your cell phones on silent. The show is about to begin. Quite does he not, does he not? Who is that? Um, <laughs> is that Alicia Keys? I think that sounded pretty good if I do say so myself. Does he not go off the echo in? Yeah, we don't want echo on. Oh, do we not? Well, hello. I yeah. thought it made me sound a bit better. Alicia's boring. I repeat, Alicia's boring. I just licked it. <laughs> What's next? I think Adele's a good character. I feel like you need something a bit more upbeat. Your upbeat is shouting down my It's because I'm laughing. Is it TVO1? Okay, so now I think if I play music through it, it's a double whammy. I've had my hair's falling out and everything after the show. The show took it out of me. What is going on here? It's poofing. Fucking it. <laughs>
going to say maybe it's my singing. Well, thanks guys for watching our Sunday karaoke. Thank you, Grandma. Did you enjoy the show? Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll be here again next week. And we bye bye. How much are your tickets to your shows? Tenner. Cheapest chips. Yeah! Hello! Hello! Goodbye, my friend. Bye bye. Goodbye, my See lover. Soon. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye, Alicia. Goodbye, my friend. You have been the one. You have been the one for me. You have been the one for me. You're so close. You're so close. Pat. Bye, Pat. Have a beautiful New Year, Pat. We'll see you on Wednesday. The goods have arrived. Mum's just throwing little things at us. I don't know what's going on with my hair. Zoom on that. It looks so good. I'm gonna squeeze my lemon. This is what it's looking like. It is incredible. It's lemony, it's garlicky, it's buttery, prawny. Bon appetit. Hi friends. It's a little bit later now. I am now back home after our little singathon, the little Eurovision that I was doing at home with that microphone. Apologies to all your ears if you were listening to that on a any volume, not even a loud volume, because I know I sound like a drowning half dead mammal cat of some sort but yeah I had a great time at mum and dad's <laughs> this came for a brew we had the Napoli and it was so cute I just love spending my Sundays like that and then I just drove home and I just planned what I am filming tomorrow what I am doing tomorrow I mean Sam watched The Apprentice because Sam also came home like pretty early as well from his mum's I'm currently bathing in my Seaplast Balm by La Roche-Posay it's so good I found basting it on my nose has really helped my is it sebaceous filaments basically the blackheads on my nose which aren't blackheads you literally don't go away but I've just basted this on my nose the past four or five nights now I had a hydrofacial and then every night since I've like basted this on my nose because I saw a hack of it on TikTok and I think it's really helped I also like to pop it over like any closed breakouts or breakouts that are up and coming because I think it just helps soothe them a little bit moisturize them so they don't go dry and you know all that good stuff Stuff. but I do have a little spot on my forehead which is playing up right now I know this is so unhygienic but it's probably a bit juicy because I've just like double cleansed my skin so I'm gonna pop that over and I'm just taking my spot patches these are the COSRX ones I swear by them I need to wipe it a bit more I'm just gonna hold this on there try and dry it off then we can pop that right on there pop the spot patch on let's put a bit of my Ula Henriksen on I'm putting a red tingy one on for what reason I don't know I was gonna heatless curl my hair but can I be bothered I really just kind of want to get in bed with my little seaplast face but that's all I'm really gonna do and again I was gonna tan to my face but can he be bothered because I've got all this seaplast on my face so I can't turn on my face so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go to bed now I think Sam's putting the new Sidemen video on because it is Sunday so I think we're gonna watch that and go to bed and then it's a new week a fresh start I'm gonna vlog the whole of next week and just show you like a full-on week in my life what we're doing what we're getting up to all that good stuff but thank you so much for watching this little weekend vlog I hope you enjoyed it I hope it's long enough I think I've got bits of everything to be fair so it should should be around the 30 minute mark I like my vlogs to be like 30 40 minutes I would have them longer like I'd have an hour long vlog I never seem to have crazy amounts of footage because I don't want to bore you like show you things that are just kind of like boring if you know what I mean but let me know let me know your thoughts on all of that and thank you so much for watching I'll see you in the next one bye